Aloha, welcome back. It's happy hour at Smuggler's Cove. We're down here in the boathouse here in San Francisco, California. And today I brought an actual Hawaiian with me to make a little something special for you. This is Jackie and she's gonna be making La Perla Rosa. I did grow up in Hawaii, but I'm also half Italian. Ah. My mother grew up in Milan. Okay. Um, and so I have this, sometimes have this problem trying to take those two halves of who I am and bring them together. And right, what right, right. better way to do that than in a cocktail? Absolutely, perfect spot. Yes, so I'm gonna make for you La Perla Rosa, mm. which is a cocktail that I developed when working here. Do you remember that? No. Briefly, oh, yeah, there was, very yeah. briefly, that one time. That, yeah. It was, it was a long okay. time ago. Anyways, so I had to come up with this cocktail because some of those tiki files out there that come into Smuggler's Cove often, um, they are known to drink through all 80 of your cocktails on your list and need something else. They are a thirsty lot, it's true. <laughs> and so they would say, Jackie, you amazing bartender you, can you please come up with something creative and delicious that's tiki inspired for me? I say, sure, I gotcha. Let's do something that is inspired by the flavors of Italy, but using the language of tiki. I like it. Tell me more about the language of tiki. I mean, we know that it's different than classic cocktails, but you know, it's, it's uh, kind of hard to explain to people sometimes. It is kind of hard to explain. You know, I, I came from learning co classic cocktails, and when I came to work here at Smuggler's Cove, um, it was a really interesting transition because classic cocktails are, uh, are sort of built on classic ratios. True, um, true. Whereas with tiki cocktails, it really is almost a free-for-all. Madness. Total madness. Total madness. <laughs> That's but a lot fun. of fun. Yes, yeah, absolutely. exactly. So, um, so yeah, so this cocktail was inspired by that, but inspired by the people who love tiki cocktails, but also inspired by my heritage. Cool. Give it a little shake. Little of my Tahitian dancing skills. Oh, nice. Glass of ice here. Add a little bit of soda water just to extend that rich drink. Make it not too unctuous. You can also toss all these ingredients, except for the soda water, into a blender. Mm -hmm. Frappe that bad boy, and you're nice. good to go. Mm -hmm. Perfect poolside deliciousness. That? I do. It sounds, sounds like, like the ocean. It sounds like sunshine. And it looks beautiful. Lovely drink. Thank you. Garnish it with a little orange slice. Just a reminder of uh, those fresh ingredients that are in there. Very pretty. What would you say when you serve that? I would say, here's your La Perla Rosa. Chaloha. 